what up Fakafano? Welcome back to another video. This is the first video since COVID-19 lockdown. I'm here with the brother Kano. Because it's hail Kane. Yeah. Kane is in my bubble. I just want to make that clear right now. That Kano is in my bubble. He's my family. So before you guys go riding hey you guys should be two meters apart and stuff he's been in my bubble since the start of lockdown and all of that so just so you guys know and don't get all fidgety about it because i've seen it on other videos some people are a little bit upset about the social distancing but me and kano we're kind of family well we are family and we're in each other's bubble so i'll just clear that up straight away so we're on the back at the lowlands today is my birthday and uh, i've taken the day off work and we're going to catch some fish. Our first fish is just down there. And hopefully I can land it. Because uh, today, today I am fishing with the fiberglass uh, three weight. Kano's on the six weight. And um, I got given a few flies by uh, Reuben of uh, Reuben Dainty Flies. And so I'm going to give, give them a crack today. And then I'll... Uh, I'll, I'm gonna switch to Reese's flies and uh, see if we can catch some fish on there. But yeah, it's just gonna be another Lowlands video. You guys smashed that last Lowlands video. You seem to enjoy it. So yeah, bit of four-wheel driving. Gonna have a fry up as well. Gonna catch some fish. Should be a good day. It's uh, overcast, so it's awesome conditions. I'm gonna get into it. So stay tuned. Be a good two pounder. Just make sure you you land your fly right. Yeah, I'm good. Birthday fish. First proper cast, I was trying to get him down here. But, oh no. Not a bad fish, you know. He's not a bad fish. Hey, look at the bend in this rod. <laughs> Check that shit out. <laughs> Bro, that's like full circle, man. Okay, that's not... a nice boat. Yeah. Those, those sticks. Oh. Give me in those sticks. Yeah, there was two in there, too. There was. Yeah. That's a nice fish. Fresh is. healthy fish. Yeah. Perfect hook. Yeah, dog. Yeah. <laughs> that's, a fish. Oh, that's a sick fish. <laughs> you yeah, man. All right, there we are. Nice flipping three and a half pound little stream rainbow. And uh, zoom in on that, mate. There you go, Reuben. Reuben's dainty flies. Flipping caught on like a soft hackle pheasant tail. Bit of pheasant tail, mate. That's a fucking stunning fish. Get that out. See if we can get that out. There you go, mate. <laughs> Heaps of energy. Yeah, dog. Me. All right, so. Kano. We were literally like 100 meters from where I caught my fish. Now, nah, so where your dry landed is where that fish is. So you need to go up like under that tree. Yeah, leave that. Ooh. The jud oh, oh yeah. Ah. I'll get it, I'll get it. I get it up. Just like on that drop off. Yeah, yeah leave that. That might do yep. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> what the 
Chick that out. Bro, you just, you know, then, bro, I thought flying fish was saltwater fish, bro. <laughs> bro, what the hell? <laughs> 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 Shit, that was <one's> funny. <laughs> bro, what the hell? Oh, wait, I'm pretty sure that wasn't the fish that I saw. Alright, Kano's got that one little one. I've got that three pounder, it's pretty sweet. But now, I found another. One just in there, and Kane is going to have another crack because that old flying fish, nah, doesn't cut cut the mustard. No, no way. We've also got a digger working. Uh, where is he? He's like, oh, there. Just there. There's a digger there, and that muddied about, oh, I don't know, three kilometres of river for <laughs> for us to fish. So we've just boosted up past him, and um, like literally 200 metres past the digger, we've seen one fish spooked it. And uh, there's another fish. Kano's gonna go do the deed now. Try to. Try to, yeah. But no, nah, I'm full confidence, mate. Full belief in you. <laughs> like, if you don't catch it, it's pretty trash. Like, pretty much first cast, you should catch this fish. Double team bow and arrow cast? Or you could just, like, stand, like. Yeah, yeah, standing there. Yeah, bro, but you just get just above it. You're on. It's just sitting in there. Kano, if he just gets this first cast right, he should be on. Should all be on. Oh, he's coming across. Yep. No, it's all. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. <laughs> oh no! He came across with it. Oh, he turned and absolutely demolished that. Like, was that a brown? Nah, that was definitely a brown. <laughs> I think you just dropped the brown. Bro. But you. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> that was a nice fish too. Uh, oh, next fish, Kano. Next fish, bro. Be just up. Hey, yeah. Hey, what's up, Q? Hey, what's up? What's up, OG? Hey, hey, Q. Hey, hey. This is OG, Kane's dog. Here, OG, OG, come here. Come here. This is... Kane's dog, OG, she's going to be a up and dear machine when she gets a bit older. How old's OG? Uh, six. Yeah, she's six months, so she's got a fair bit of growing to go, but yeah. Yeah. She's come along for the run. Fish are pretty spooky for uh, fish that probably haven't been fished to in five weeks. Don't expect anybody's fish to them, but it's low and clear. So I guess the fish a little bit on edge, but that's alright. So we're we'll just driving driving along. And there's two fish like just here and we spooked them, but they've come back and one's eating off the top. But Kane's getting out. I think this is sixth time lucky, Kane. Yeah, sixth time lucky. We'll see if we can. You go for this back one, mate, and then pull them back, and then I'll catch that top one. We'll go with that, eh? Yeah. Sounds... Put down the main run? Yeah, but don't go too high up, because then you'll spook my fish. <laughs> That's alright, just lead it, let it drift past. Okay, now go again, but like in the middle. <laughs> oh, you just spooked it. Because <laughs> you went too far up, mate. No, it's spooked. They've both gone. Pretty rough, pretty rough. Probably spooked. Oh. 
Say 10 odd fish. Be pretty close, okay, no? Yeah, man. Spooked 10 odd fish. Dropped one each. Dropped one each. Caught one each. So, so far, she's not great. And I don't know what we're, we're up to after this. I might go and uh, visit a couple places and just try something a bit different, but um, on the way home. But right now, it's the time. It's uh, almost one o'clock, so yeah, we've still got maybe another hour or so of fishing, but um, where that is, I don't know yet. But uh, we're just gonna have a fry up. What's on the menu, Kano? What have we got here? Benny backstrap. Nice Benny backstrap. That's it. Is that a bit of pink Himalayan salt? Oh, yeah, man. Oh, a little bit of pink Himalayan salt on there. A couple of cuts made in the backstrap. Oh, I better put the essentials in the fridge, mate. Oh, all right. Got a bit of doof doof going on in here, but oh, look at that. Bit of essentials. We've got this thing that I've never tried before. But uh, just go put them in the fridge. They're still pretty cold from uh, when they were in my fridge uh, when I got them out this morning, but oh, look at this. The water's pretty cold. And by the time, uh, put that in there, and that, there, there we go, put this bad boy in there, look at that, fridge, they're in the fridge now, and they'll be, they'll be greatly appreciated in about 10 minutes I think, but uh, yeah, now, we're going to have a fry up and then uh, reassess what's going to go on, so. Yeah, montage of the fire. going pretty good. Kana has given me the first little taste there to eat so ah, hot mm. yeah bro that's me alright mm. real good what right. go to the fridge oh, really hot Go to the fridge. Gonna pull out a pull out a beer. Mm. Cold as. Mm. Now this beer was uh, given to me by a real good friend. Thank you very much, Roy Wilson. My, uh, he's my good work buddy, uh, and yeah, he gave me this beer, and he said it's the only beer you could find it with a fish on it. As you can see, Orange Ruffy. Now, it says Hazy Tropical Pale Ale, craft beers. Not a huge fan of craft beer, but um, you know, it's got a fish on it. Was gifted it, very thankful for it, so it'd be rude of me not to flip and skull, have a skull. Finish the beer. Thank you very much, Roisy, for this uh, for this beer. <coughs> Got a bit carried away. <coughs> Went down the wrong hole. Oh. <coughs> oh. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not a bad beer. It kind of feels like it's got a. It definitely has a hazy tropical taste to it. Taste of beer. 
kind of like a someone put a dash of like uh, fresh up in, in a beer. So it's not bad. Cheers, Rosie. Ah, there it is. There it is. Have a taste, Kano. Good, eh? Bloody good, eh? Yeah. Benny white bread and butter. Bit of salt. Probably could have done with some tea sauce. No. Bit of tea sauce, but who's complaining? Crack on with us. Alright, me and Kano have made a plan. We're going to go to the river mouths of a couple of streams. I'm putting this away. I'm going to get out the check nook and fish the big, deep Rangataiki River. So, yeah, we're going to go. And, uh, well, Kane's going to make his lead longer. I'm going to change my rod. And then we're going to boost off up there to the river mouth. Fish there for about probably 10 15 minutes. Go to another river mouth, fish there for. 10-15 minutes depending on how it goes and then um well pardon me that'll be the day so that's the plan guys it's the plan so hopefully we can get a couple more oh slabby came bro <laughs> get in this eddy here bro well that's an awesome fish that's a big fish, bro. Bro, that's a that's a cool fish, bro. Fuck, that's a Four pound. Bro, check out that, bro. That is slabby canebo to the max. Slabby, no, it's not even that slabby, no. Right. Got the yeah. Not sure it's that fish, bro. Look at that. That's a nice bow, bro. It's a fucking epic bow. Beautiful. Well done, man. Alright, sick. Oh, there's a proper fish, bro. Yeah. Proper fish. <laughs> Alright, so this is my second fingerling of this spot. Kane's Kane got that nice one you saw just before. And I've been catching these things on the uh, New Zealand fishing flies jig hook. It's like in green. Don't know what it's called. It's in green silver bead and I've got a hair and copper on the bottom, but these little bastards. Oh, one like Kane's one. Get out of here. All right, team. I caught two fingerlings. Kane. Oh. Yeah. Kane just had another one, <laughs> but uh, he's got one. Snapped you off. Oh. Snapped them off. There's some big fish in here. Big, big fish in here. It was just the gamble throw of the dice and paid off. So good on Kano for getting the. A nice, nice cane bow, as, as you like to call it. And uh, yeah, I got a couple of fingerlings, but oh well. It sucks. It sucks. It was a, a day of misfortune, really. Um, but that's all right. That's fishing. Well, I dropped one. Kane dropped one. Kane spooked six. I spooked a couple. But oh well, that's fishing. The the, the water's low and. We've got to wait for a flood to come through and then I think this place will get pumping so yeah but thanks for coming along for the ride had a good feed as well and had, had a bit of fun in the doing a bit of four-wheel driving so yeah thank you all for watching if you did like make sure you subscribe do all that good stuff um, make sure you head over to nzfishingflies.com they've um, they, they've helped me out so much and uh, right now is a tough time for local businesses um, so make sure you head over there make sure you go to maxcatch.nz.co.nz uh, check out their stuff um, I believe a price has gone down since my last video on some of the stuff so go check that out and uh, maybe pick yourself up a new rod and um, yeah so that's it once again thanks for watching I'll see you next time which should hopefully be fairly soon
Later.